Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. For those who already know me and for those who don't, welcome. My name is Michael, I'm a French guy reacting most of the time in English to music videos that I'd like to share with you and some that I'd like to discover with you. And uh, last uh, time I did a reaction um, to a song uh, by Putri Ayani and someone in the comments just um, asked me to react to a cover she did of the single uh, Desert Rose. I think that's a Sting song. So um, it's during the Indonesian culture and creativity um, performance in 2024. So it's quite new. And uh, yes, I think uh, it's a beautiful song. I know this song. If it's the one I'm thinking about, it's a beautiful song. So um, I would like to um, to listen to Putri singing this song and to see how she's going to, you know, make this song hers. So, okay, if you already know this performance, I'm pretty sure you're going to enjoy watching it and listening to it once again. And if you're just like me discovering it, we're probably going to have a good time together. So let's go with Putri Ariani singing Desert Rose at the Indonesian Cultural and Creativity event. A dream of rain, a dream of gardens in the desert, waking vain, a dream of love as time runs through my head, a dream of fire, streams have died to a host that will never die, and in the flames, a Shadows play in the shape of the man's design. It stands a rose, yeah, yeah, yeah. Shadows fail, a secret promise. It's just a flower, yeah, 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 yeah. No sweet perfume ever told to me more than this. Okay, so um, <clears throat> first, uh, of course, her voice is uh, is is great. It's perfect. It's a typical Putri Ayani's performance. So it's uh, it's great, obviously. The only thing uh, I would say that maybe I think it was too 
too strong, too powerful. And maybe uh, I, I love the way she, at the, in the second time, after the first chorus, uh, she tried to lower a bit uh, the intensity of her, of her singing. And, um, and uh, yes, because it's a bit of fragile too. And uh, otherwise, it, it, I was kind of shocked because it was really strong. Uh, at the beginning, really raw, really strong, and really uh, sharp. And uh, I said, okay, so why is that so strong? And then at the, uh, in the middle, she tried to, yes, make it more soft. And um, and yes, this is kind of, I like it more, to be honest. But otherwise, yeah, it's just a piano and a voice. Uh, at the end, they, they decided to use a bit of reverb and they should have done it at the beginning too. But uh, yes, it, it adds something to this performance because when you when you know the original version, you know that there is a lot of arrangement behind and a lot of uh, harmony, uh, harmonizations and um, a lot of, uh, you know, instruments and backing vocals and everything. So if you finally get rid of all of this, yeah, it's totally different. It's difficult. And yeah, she, she managed to catch you uh, just with her voice and with a piano. So uh, this is a, an interesting performance. Uh, maybe not the one, one of the, my favorite performance from her, to be honest. But uh, that's that's a great performance, and yes, you you have to be brave to 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 do that. Just piano voice and strong like this, and um, yeah, really interesting. So let me know what you think about that, of course. And uh, by the way, if you enjoyed my video, please remember to subscribe to my channel, to click on the like button, to share my channel, and uh, I will appreciate it. And uh, of course, I hope to talk to you soon, guys. Take care. Bye bye.